Hey guys, welcome to Infotainment on our Forever TV. I'm your girl, Love Vitian. Don't forget to click on that subscribe button. The first three wrestlers of Raw Surviving Series Men's Team have been revealed. Now AJ Styles, Keith Lee and Sheamus will be part of Team Raw at next month's Survivor Series pay-per-view. There are two spots remaining on Team Raw for men's 5 on 5 elimination march against SmackDown. Styles, Lee and Sheamus are one Survivor Series qualifying matches on Tuesday's episode of Raw. Now Styles defeated Jeff Hardy while Lee defeated Alias and Sheamus. Sheamus defeated Matt Riddles. Raw Surviving Series women's team has been fully revealed as well. It will feature Shayna Baszler, Nia Jax, Mandy Rose, Dana Brooke, and Lana. Surviving Series is taking place on the 22nd of November. Now, in WWE Champion Randy Orton versus Universal Champion Roman Reigns. Raw Women's Champion Asuka versus SmackDown Women's Champion Sasha Banks. Raw Tag Team Champion the new day including Kofi Kingston and Xavier Woods versus SmackDown Tag Team Champions, The Street Profits, Angela Dawkins and Montez Ford. Now United States Champions Bobby Lashley versus Intercontinental Champion Sami Zayn. Now Men's 5 on 5 Survivor Series Elimination March goes as follows. Team Raw, AJ Styles, Keith Lee, Sheamus and two wrestlers to be announced versus Team SmackDown. Down, five wrestlers to be announced. Now, women's five on five Survivor Series elimination match goes as follows Team Raw, you have Shayna Baszler, Nia Jax, Mandy Rose, Dana Brooke, and Lana versus the Team SmackDown. Five wrestlers to be announced. Now, keep in mind the 13th anniversary of The Undertaker will be celebrated at the Survivor Series. Former champs Mike Tyson and Roy Jones Jr. will face each other for a new belt created by WBC, which has also revealed that the fight will be judged by three former champions with scores declared between rounds. The faces of both men in their prime together with a circular Black Lives Matter logo next to a race first beside the image of young Tyson, futures on the light green belt unveiled ahead of the Veterans Clash on November 28. A circular display of flags of countries surrounds the words Black Lives Matter in the middle of the design which has been named the WBC Frontline Battle Belt by organizers. Why the California State Athletic Commission has warned that no knockout will be allowed. The governing body has announced the qualities that will allow either returning powerhouse to impress a panel of three champions who will serve as judges for the contest. Now, the commission executives have insisted that neither Hall of Famer will be allowed to hurt each other when they finally meet at the Dignity Health Sports Park in California, but the introduction of a belt could add more edge to a showpiece that both fighters clearly want to win in style. Now ahead of the first pre-fight press conference later this week, Tyson shared a promotional video with his following of more than 13 million on Instagram that featured his claim to be an annihilator and the greatest fighter since the conception of God. Meanwhile, Jones Jr. is seen in the trailer bragging that this is easy and I can do it. Now the former four weight champion has has not fought since 2018 but is undefeated in four fights, winning the German version of the WBU Cruiserweight title and a WBF Cruiserweight belt in his last two contests. This will definitely be an interesting fight, so who are you rooting for? Make sure to leave a comment on the comment section down below. Let's take a minute to congratulate six-time world champion Lewis Hamilton, who is now Formula One's record all-time race winner with a dominant 90-second career victory at the Portuguese Grand Prix. All right, guys, it's a wrap for this edition. Make sure to click on that subscribe button for more updates and be kind enough to leave a comment. Thanks for watching Infotainment on Authorable TV.